I am that is. My sword shall wield for me. Clooney, you may believe you have scored a victory by stealing Martin from us, but you do not understand this tapestry's magic. Its power may surprise you. Beware, Clooney, beware. Chief, what's happened? Uh, should we sound the call to arms? It's too late for that. You wretched vermin. If there had been an assassin, I'd be dead by now. Wouldn't I? Uh, gee, Chief, uh, I guess you would. Dead cold and ready to go on the ground. Get out! Oh, no. No. Oh, yes, Chief. I'll not live in fear of some ghostly mouse. I know how to silence his spirit. I'll crush Redwall Abbey and everyone in it! Ah! But I've got to get inside Redwall. That's the only way to end this. Absolutely! <laughs> I'd have been oh. even quicker to kill Corny had he been in the way. Your tail I fell over! Chase the first. Much quicker that time, wasn't it, Chief? Shut up. Shutting up, Chief. The next assault on Redwall must come quickly. But I can't lead in this condition. Oh, <laughs> so you want me to take over. An excellent choice, Chief. Silence! I need my leg fixed. I need a healer. Oh. Understood? Uh-huh. Understood. <gasps> that vixen Sella knows the old ways, and her good-for-nothing son, Chicken Hound. <laughs> we'll do, Chief. I'll have them both back here before... Get out! Prepare, if you can, Red Wall. Cluny is coming, and no mouse, alive or otherwise, is going to stop him. What's this? Matthias, there you are. It's been a long time since you ate. I thought you might be hungry. Thanks, Cornflower. I'm starving. Matthias, Cornflower. Look at this. I am that is. The same words were on the tapestry. Yes. Most curious that someone wrote them out again. Almost as if they expected the tapestry to be stolen. I am that is. Matt. Hat. Sit. This. What are you doing? Oh, <laughs> sorry. It's just a game my father taught me. See how many words you can make out of a sentence. You just juggle the letters around. See? Hit, sat, mat, Matthai. Matthias. What? Matthias. Unmix the letters and the message reads, I, Matthias. That's impossible. This was written long before I was born. Look, there's more. What kind of words are these? It's written in the old hand. What does it say? Read it to me! <laughs> Patience, young one. The warrior sleeps twixt hall and cavern hole. I am that is 
take on my mighty role. What? What does it mean? It would seem it is a message from Martin to you, young Matthias. Take on my mighty role. That can't be right. I'm no warrior. The warrior sleeps twixt hall and cavern hole. Hmm. Martin's tomb was never found, was it, Methuselah? Sadly, no, though many tried to uncover it. Twixt hall and cavern hole. Wait a minute. Brothers, come with me. Enough! Give me the herbs. The herbs without the magic may not have the desired effect, O oh Great One. If you and your idiot son want to leave here alive, give me the herbs now! As you wish, my master. Chicken Hound. Where are the plans? <laughs> right here, Chief. Just like you ordered. This is how we get inside. Oh, a battering ram! Work on the ram is to start immediately. Construction is to be completed by sunup. Red Wall will be in our hands by midday tomorrow. Or breakfast may be the last meal you ever eat. Am I making myself clear? Got it, Aye, Chief. Uh, absolutely. Yes, sir. Now, if you're all done with your business, I'd like to get to work on that leg. Well, what are you waiting for? Right, <laughs> with any luck, they'll all be killed in the attack. It must be very difficult for you, oh great one. Here, drink this down while I apply your poultice. It will help you sleep. Does this help with nightmares? Most assuredly, Your Honor. Your sleep will be long and restful. <laughs> A good sleep would help. And a good sleep you shall have. How does that feel, Your Honor? Your Highness? <laughs> Who's the idiot now? <laughs> <laughs> Who indeed? Hear that? It's hollow. And we are definitely twixt hall and cavern hole. Look at these letters. See how red wall is written so it can be read going up or down? So? This middle stair, see the letter there? The W is an M when seen upside down. M for Martin. And for Matthias. Let's see if we can move it. It's hopeless. Your moles! Getting out of light. Well, well, Mr. Formal. Letting him dog a bone there. What did he say? <laughs> Get out of the way. Ah. We're having a bit of trouble with this stair, Mr. Formal. Don't suppose you could help us move it? Uh huh. About the same as my grandmum do find when she's rootin' round olden time fortifications. His grandmother found steps like these in the old ruins. Yep, yep. Don't need digging or breaking. Just turn them after dusting. Ah, that him be. All and bean pollen, boys. 
mercy come, heaven you please, move and move, slide and grease. Take that an interesting turn then. She's selling you out, Chief. She's got the plans. They're fake. We're not building a battering ram. No, but they'll think we are. And while they spend their time shoring up the front gate, we'll proceed with the real attack. And by dawn, Red Wall will be mine. <laughs> How many summers it's been since any mouse walked these halls? Untold generations, I'm sure. Have you noticed we still seem to be going down? Down indeed. This is the farthest underground I've ever been. This must be it. Martin's tomb. It may well be. But how do we get inside? Look up there. More old writing. Can you read it, Methuselah? The same as the steps betwixt the hall, remember and look to the center of all. Look to the center of all. Uh, maybe we should all go in together. And you think this is a fake? It's too easy, especially coming from Cellar and Chickenheart. It sounds as though they went to great personal risk. Do you want to place the fate of Redwall Abbey in that pair's hands? This plan is meant to distract us, Abbot, nothing more. So, what do you suggest we do? Turn the tables. Use it to our own advantage. By mounting a counterattack now, when they least expect it. I'm sorry, Constance, to mount an unprovoked attack. I'm afraid I could never sanction that. We'll have to think of something else. Silence! While the defenders inside Redwall prepare for an attack at their front door, we will enter Redwall by a different route. For the entranceway to Red Wall lies not above the ground, but below it. Huh? The way into Red Wall is through a tunnel, a tunnel you will dig tonight. Why aren't you digging? Yes, sir! We're coming, Red Wall. We're coming. Martin's tomb. You look a lot like him, Matthias. He does bear an uncanny resemblance. The door! We're locked in! Matthias, Martin's shield. And look there, his belt. Can you see the sword? Alas, no. Try it on. No, I can't. I couldn't. Do you really think I should? It's a perfect fit. A perfect fit indeed. Now the shield. There can be no doubt, young Matthias. Methuselah, there must be some mistake. I am a mere mouse. There's no mistake, Matthias. You are the next great defender of Redwall. Not if we don't find a way out of here. Ah, there you are. <sighs> Mr. Formo told me I'd find you lot down here. I say, beastly dank old place, hey, what? We have to act now. It may be the last chance we have. But it is not our way. Let us concentrate on fortifying the front gate. You 
are making a mistake. Sella and Chicken Hound will do anything for money. Oh, no! I left them alone in the Great Hall. I'll look after them. The rest of you, finish this. Come to some agreement. Father Abbot, Constance is right. I agreed we can't attack, but we can take other steps to defend ourselves. Can't we? Well... If the plans are a ruse, shouldn't we be trying to find out how Clooney is going to get into Redwall? This would satisfy you? Anything. So long as we don't just stand here. We'd better spread out and start looking. But what are we looking for, old bean? I don't know. But I'm sure we'll know when we see it. Strange. I feel like something been digging. Good news, Chief. We're under the Abbey Courtyard. About time. Down the hall, all of you. Any last orders, Chief? Just one. Win or die. What are you doing? Stop! Stop! Help! Oh. 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 Is he dead? Who cares? Let's get out of here! Leave them to the others. Why? Matthias, there's bad news. What's happened? It's old Methuselah. Is he? No, he's alive. But he's badly hurt. Matthias, I've words to speak with you. It was Chicken Hound, wasn't it? Him and Sella. Probably, but that doesn't matter right now. Yes, it does. I know you're hurting, Matthias, but you can't let your pain blind you. Cornflower's right. Well, what am I supposed to do? Ask yourself the important question. Who's really behind this? Clooney? Yes. Where is Clooney? Master Matthias, them words is what I've been trying to speak in. I think I know where him is. What? Feel him. Someone down below be digging. <gasps> Father Abbott, could you please get everyone together, quickly? Of course, my son. What are we having for breakfast? Matthias, this really isn't the time to be thinking of food. Cornflour. All right. Um, porridge. Hot porridge? Done, everyone, and with porridge yet. <laughs> well done. How is Methuselah? Only time will tell. And what about this traitor? Oh dear. Yes, I suppose there must be some form of punishment, mustn't there? Bury her up to her neck in red ants, then hang the wretch from the tower before you draw and quarter her. Or we could let her go. Are you crazy? Not really, but Clooney is. I'm sure he will know how to deal with her. Uh, now, wait a minute. There's no need for that. Uh, I'm sure we can come to a better arrangement. I, I, I can be of great service. I'm a healer, after all. I'm a healer! If 
I were you, I'd run. Ah! Matthias! <laughs> <laughs> They'll never find me now. <laughs> I made it. Hello? I is somebody there? Asmodeus. Asmodeus. Come with me, young foxy. I will show you... Eternity. 